M0FXB, massive thanks to Peter G7RPG for sending me information on the Mumble system that I have never used before. So it's actually connected now. If I just turn up the volume on it. So it's connected. It's just going to make sure I'm going down a bit. It's connected to Hubnet. Now, if I turn up my, I've got my All Star node here also connected to Hubnet. And when someone speaks, just a little pause there. That's Hubnet. So if you've not used an All Star node before, it's a box with a radio in it. It's transmitting on a set frequency using, and it's linked to the internet via Raspberry Pi. To every analog radio I've got, it, it can be a budget one or it could be one of the super duper ones. There's the new FTX one. Okay. It's picking up exactly the same frequency. Okay. And, and I, like, I like using both. So if we look here on the right hand side, the mumble link that I've got, it says we provide downloads for the official client and server programs. A Linux distribution may provide their own packages uh, and have their own maintainer, which we'll describe below. We also link to some third party projects. So there you are. I mean, is it VOIP? G7 RPG is going to tell us more. It says at the top here, open source, low latency, high quality voice chat. Um, so is it is it something like uh, a bit like what Hamshack Hotline use, where they use the SIP system to connect everything together? Uh, is it All Star? We're going to learn more to get. So you're hearing it now on my Windows PC, but it's it will work on Android. Let's just give a quick quick call out to G0CDX. See if he can hear me. If it sounds a bit doubly, it's because I've got two microphones here. Let's try it. Sound. Oh, what did I do? M0 FXB, am I being received? I'm not sure. Let's just turn up. See, there's my radio. I'll turn it up quite loud and we'll try it again. Now, I had to go in and tell it to add this PTT. So let's try again. M0FXB calling for a contact. No, I don't think that's com that's working. Let me just go to the configuration page. Hello UK, UI4VT calling. I'm receiving it fine. UI4VT calling. So settings Hello, at the UK. top. Anybody on duty? <laughs> uh, and this is literally the first time I've done this. If you look here, it says push to talk. And I chose, let's just click apply, click OK. Let's close that down, go back in settings, push to talk, look. You've got double push time here and hold time, which I've not selected, but I did tick display push to talk window and it has done that. And you've got compression, noise, noise compression. There is, I've seen an, an audio test for this. So let's just click apply, click OK, and let's try that little window again. And I've got my, I will know if it transmits because when I go PTT, this will go into receive. So M0 FXB test, 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 one, two, three, test, test. Maybe I haven't got, um, you know, PTT permission yet. You can see I'm connected to Hubnet link just here. And there's my call sign highlighted. If I double click, we can actually send messages. Uh, the server, so we connected to the server figures. If I go server connect, you have to put in, we're connected to hub.openSRC.mx, yeah? Uh, let's try here, if I go, no, that's not gonna let me. So we're connected to a server, M0 FXB calling for a contact, one, two, three, test. Yeah, nothing's coming through here. I still find it interesting. 
Now, I'll put the link in the description so you can download it. Please email d7rpg at hotmail.com for more info. If we look on the left here, enable to enter breakfast. This is where I've been trying to connect to things. So what I've been doing is just going to different rooms. So here's an all-star here. Right click and I've gone join. And it won't let me, but the all-star one, right click, join. That one did let me. Uh, adding the respective access password token. Where is it? Are we looking at the top? The server request push to talk to be enabled. Now I thought that was enabled. Um, so let's just go configure settings. And device, default device for interface. Yeah, it's just using my microphone. Push to talk. So here it is, this is what I chose. Push to talk, maybe if I put these sliders up. Now, Peter has told me that he will help me with all this. But of course, as soon as I got it working, I had to make a video. So I'm going to go apply, click OK. Do push to talk. M0 FXB test test. One, two, test. Yes, it's not coming through. Let's have a look at the link that he sent me and how I actually connected to it. And as we scroll down we've got a windows client windows server and this you know this is customizable it's, it's open source that's the whole point mac uh, mac server what else we got here github links linux android it says i think we have to pay for android i think we've got f well let's try a couple you've got the play one here let's have a look now uh, that one looks like that one isn't charging. The other one I clicked was asking, oh, I see you get the choice to have it or have it for free. <laughs> I'll put both the links in the description. There's another one here called Mumla F Droid. So yeah, we're gonna add it to our phone, but I'll do that now and just see what it looks like. So you'll see my Android phone. I'm now gonna put in my instructions. So where it says label, I'm to type H-U-B uh, dot open src dot mx effectively this is an ip address um address same okay same again hub dot open src this is on an android phone of course Username is my call sign, M0FXB. Not sure if it let me in twice. Password leave blank and then go add. And that's it, I'm connected. I'm going to allow all the permissions. Like so. Now, you know, you know, as you know, I learn in front of you. Like I get. I do, believe it or not, I get a million views a month. Okay, a million views a month. I probably get in that million views three or four people uh, message me uh, complaining about my content. You don't know what you're doing. Um, you've done that. You know, just you've done it incorrect. Misinformation. Uh, all that, all those kind of messages. Yeah, and please just remember, I'm just going to allow these certificates. I'm learning, you're watching, and that's your choice to watch. I'm not Yesu Icon, I'm not anyone. I'm Andreas, sat in my shack, I'm enjoying my hobby, I'm having fun. I invite everyone to come on my dog walks with me. Let's just go away. I'm just a friendly person sharing my interest. So to the people, and there you are, it's just appeared now, who send, and there aren't many. Remember, a million a month, three or four a month, yeah? Uh, 22... 22 million views, 50,000 subscribers, it'll be 100,000 because my content basically helps people use radios um, that are complicated, you know. It helps me and then because I filmed it, it helps everyone. Lucky me, you know, I, I, can, I can get lots of radios partly funded by my hobby, yeah. Um, so to the people that send those negative messages to me, please go away, leave me alone, yeah. Um, I'm just trying to help myself, then that helps others. That's all it is, yeah? Please. Yeah, but anyway, so I had a message today. It's like, leave me alone. But anyway, um, so it's flashing red. 
um, current chat target. So if I go back to one of these other, look, G7 RPG, uh, who, uh, yeah, it's Peter, but it does say he's away, so I, I think he's busy at the moment. So let's hold our finger on one of these. And then we're going to go, no, local mute. So three dots there. No, let's just tap it. So uh, as I said, I actually don't know how to start chatting with people. My friend MXLSJ is also going to have a go at this with me. Mute, deafen, speaker, local mute, ignore message. So you can mute me. We've got full control there. Uh, if I go back, uh, so I'm not sure why that's chatting red there. Let's do register. I've just done that, held it. So maybe it, when it's linked, it's a bit, it reminds me of the Muzzy Droid app and the, well, what's the other app we use on well, our Hamshack hotline? It reminds me of that. It's like a SIP connection. Um, ground wire, I think it's called. So that's it. I think that's enough for this video. You, I've got it on the um, app that you can see. I've got it on Windows, that you can see. Uh, we know it's, fully customizable. The source code is available to anyone. You'll see that it will work on your Mac PC. How new the Mac version is, I don't know, on iOS. Um, pretty sure I could probably download that on my iOS. Let me just see if I can send myself a link. Yeah, and I've got it on here on my phone and it'll be the same process, just adding it. It will look slightly different because it's an iPhone, but the login, the user, the address, the port, the username, it's all going to be the same. So once we get this working, we'll be able to connect to lots of people. So, you know, like it's a bit like TeamSpeak, isn't it? It's a, it's a, it's a method of communication. It's a hobby method, open source. And eventually you, you can bet people are going to link this. And they probably already have to DMR, DSTAR, Fusion, All-Star, SIP, you name it. It's all very interchangeable. Uh, and to all the people that support me, to all the people that stay positive, that um, don't watch me and just want to say nasty things. Uh, they just want to watch, either uh, enjoy having a, 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 um, the same interest, enjoy that they've picked up their FT70 that they haven't used for two years, and they search a video and they find my video, and they, they, they put a memory channel in, whether it's a Bofung, you know. Don't forget, I forget every day how to use these radios. I go back to my videos or whether it's the latest FTX one, which I bent over backwards to get um, so that I got my massive audience I've got is America. So I bent over backwards to get one because I had so many people message me saying, can't wait for you to get one because you can you can learn and we can learn with you. Yeah. And or whether it's a, a budget bow phone, which is like I, I have no preference, whether it's an Icon 52. Yeah. Which I've got here which I was the first in Europe to get one of these. Yeah. And this is the newer model or a 15 pound Bofung. I, I equally enjoy using them equally. Yeah. Um, they're all great fun. So thanks for watching. Bye for now. Catch you on air. And I am a YouTuber that goes on air every day and speaks to my ham radio friends. Bye for now. Seven, three. And of course, drones, CBs, scanners, I've got some receivers coming. I've got lots of receivers and scanners here already and they are hard to learn, but I try, yeah? I try and they are hard. 7-3, bye for now.